the highs and lows of the temperatures this fall are forcing some local farmers to adjust in order to keep their crops thriving. Not on your sides, Brianna Harper shows us how this changing weather helps shape the farming outlook. Here at Thin Meadows Farms, they're working to produce about 30 different crops. And Farmer Love tells me that helps increase their profit when unpredictable weather strikes. Anytime you have an extreme weather event, those are never going to be good for anybody. From too hot to too cold. Here we have a lot of frost tender crops. Or sometimes not enough rain. For the past seven years, Finn Meadows Farm in Montgomery has managed to adjust to the changing weather. I guess we call ourselves a Walmart, a local farm, so we try to be a one-stop shop. Producing a variety of crops like cabbage, kale, and tomatoes, enough to feed nearly 140 families each year. Pretty much every farmer you know, weather stability is an important thing, and, you know, all of us are eaters. Over the past few years, farmer Mark Luff says he's noticed a trend of warmer temps for a much longer period of the year. That means good news for those crops that thrive with a late frost, but if the cold comes too quickly, that's when greenhouses provide some protection. If it gets from hot to cold real quick, then those guys can get zapped off. Another adjustment in the case of a drought, carbon soil. The neat thing is that it'll hold eight times its weight in water. These are all steps to help increase the chance for success in a guessing game of weather. We tried to guess what's coming up and you sort of make a you place a bet basically every time you plant a crop. Brianna Harper, 9 on your side.